G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video review. Today we're going to be having a look at uh, what I believe is newly released. Um, the figure has come out before as a uh, multi-pack, Justice League pack, but uh, now the single versions of those are coming out, which is fantastic. There is the uh, the multiverse uh, DC figure of this, um, but this is the one that was in the multi-pack, and this is part of the DC Icons line. This is Batman, or the Batman Rebirth Batman. Fantastic storyline if you haven't started reading it. I highly recommend it. I think they're up to... Uh, volume 3 of the graphic novels uh, and it's still going strong in the comic form as well so you know they individually pick them up or, or pick up the graphic novels um, in this one here I, so I believe the first two releases are these two guys which is obviously Batman and Superman so there's the head sculpts there up close and as I said if you've seen the multi-pack uh, Justice League reviews these are exactly the same figure so I don't need to go into super too much detail because you've probably already watched enough of those videos to see what's going on here. But I really do like the head sculpt. I'll bring that a bit closer so you can really see. Love the menacing eyes, the jawline they've given him. Looks like he's been uh, punched around a little bit, a little bit uh, thicker in the chops, but um, still as menacing as ever and scary. I love the uh, the way they've taken the bat symbol now with the, uh, the yellow outline. And then you've got the, uh, the detailing through the abs. Uh, even to the point where we've got some of the vein work coming through now uh, in the sculpt, through the muscles. The only disappointing factor about this one is just the hands. The hands do look removable. I uh, haven't yet tried. And there's a little bit of articulation. You can pretty much move them forward and back. But you are just limited to fists. That's all he has. There's no open palm. There was nothing in the packaging, which is a little bit disappointing. Uh, no weapons, no accessories. Uh, which was really disappointing. I was hoping we would at least get a, a Batarang, which seems to be the the stock standard. You've got the gauntlets there. But um, literally, it's just a Batman figure. So if you've probably got a spare black hand lying around from a, a, another icon figure, probably another Batman icon figure or some of the weaponry that you could use, you might be able to, uh, to make good of that. But other than that, it is just, as I said, a figure. Nothing in the utility belt other than the, the nice style work. Lift up the cape there to see the back. Goes all the way around, which is nice. The continuity. Um, but yeah, as I said, it's just nice. I'll add him to the collection up there. For me, it's still the, the new 52 line. Um, I really love the way they designed those figures and, and posed them out. A little bit of articulation, but uh, they do look fantastic, especially when they brought out... I'll see if I can zoom the camera in. If you can see that up there, when they brought in uh, Darkseid and his... Uh, his goblins. You can just see at the back there. But anyway, um, fantastic line, that one. Check out those reviews. They're all, all up on YouTube on the channel. But I uh, just wanted to share this one. So here in Australia, as you can see, $38. Nothing on sale yet. Um, I think that's pretty much going to be the average price. It does work out probably cheaper if you buy the, the Justice League pack. But you've, uh, you've probably got to want all of the figures. But if you're a bit like a, a Batman fan like I am, you're going to want to grab this guy. But anyway... Thanks for watching. Keep subscribing. Thanks for uh, ticking the notifications button if you have already to, uh, to hear about when I post up new videos uh, as well as anything else in the room. Get the camera to focus there. If there's anything you want to see reviewed that isn't already reviewed on the channel, let me know and I will do my best to uh, get a review up for you all. So anyway, thanks for watching. Keep subscribing. Cheers.